We're now going to go through the process of how to create a file from scratch. So from the main menu and the home page, there is a create file option on the left hand side menu bar. Once you click here, it will then ask you which branch number. We will be loading to branch seven. Then it's a simple form you need to fill in. So now if we click to confirm the clerk's details, the next option is going to be the passenger's details. So here we'll enter that is Mr. B vertical, email address, date of birth, Once that's entered, you then click add passenger to validate that passenger. If you add a second passenger, you click create more passengers and repeat that process. Now as we come down, we can now enter the client's contact details. So here we have the address. and phone number. Then you can choose their preferred method of contact. So we'll say this is email, and then that they have um, okayed us to send them special offers. If there's any uh, special assistance, that can also be ticked here, um, and also if it's a surprise booking. Then as we come down, you've now got the lead company details. So here, we'll say that it's a jet to holidays booking, and now we have your marketing code. So your marketing codes are in a drop down. So we will say that this is a new client, which will then activate the tertiary code, which will say it came from Facebook. And if there's sub tertiaries, that will then get activated. Now, as we come down, it's asking for details of the holiday. So we will say that they are traveling here from if you type in the airport code, it will automatically populate the list below, like so, the amount of nights, and then a reference number there. You have the option to have three reference numbers if you like. Now, if you come down, you can then choose your primary code, which we will choose as Summer Sun, and then it gives you the options regarding your balance due details at the bottom. Once you're happy with that, you can at any time go up and change anything. So if you wanted to add a second phone number, you could do so. At any time, you haven't got to go through a set routine to do so. And then once you're happy, you simply click save and exit. This is now validating your file and creating a file number for you. So then you can go on now and add the costs to your file by clicking add costs or file menu add and costs. And then also all your documentation and anything else you need to do on this file.